Yo, what's up everybody? So today we're gonna be taking a look at how to create a um a commission sheet. If you plan on selling your graphic services to people, you're gonna wanna have a commission sheet where it lists all your prices and uh what you offer. So let's get right on into it. The first thing I'm gonna do is I have a 1920 by 1080 canvas right now. I'm gonna change the color to a dark gray, as you can see. And I'm gonna hit Alt Backspace, and that's just gonna fill up the canvas with my foreground color. Or right, I'm gonna use this uh, little sunrise effect. I'm going to leave a link in the description if you want to use it. I'm just gonna resize it. Check out RobloxVisuals.com for the latest Roblox graphics templates. We have just added some new FPS shooter UI templates, some full simulator UI sets. Check it out and use code YT for 15% off all purchases. And I'm gonna rasterize it as you can see this icon means it's a uh, smart object so to rasterize it you want to do Control g and then Control e and that's just basically gonna flatten it now i'm gonna hit Control u and i'm just gonna turn the saturation down and uh, i'm gonna turn this just turn this down to However much you see fits, I'm probably gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna stick with five. Okay, so I think this looks pretty good. Now, we're gonna select pencil, creates a new layer, and we're just gonna click here. This is gonna create a uh, straight line. Just click and drag, hold Alt, and click on the uh, blue square here. Hold Shift again, and just complete the shape. I'm gonna click Shape. Now, right click, Blending Options, and I'm gonna go to Gradient Overlay. Click here and let's select this uh, black to white preset. Double click here. And here is where you could choose whichever colors you want. So just go with the gradient combination that you feel looks nice. That looks really bad. This looks pretty nice. I'm gonna add a little drop shadow, just like this. I think that looks nice. Uh, I'm gonna make this drag it out a little bit. Now I'm gonna add some text. I'm gonna do put prices. The font I'm using is called Arison Comic, so you can download it. I'm gonna control T and just make this bigger and also add a shadow to this one. I might do it like this instead. That looks pretty nice. And there we go. Now I wanna add some examples um, of the work you provide. Let's go with the uh, round the rectangle. Radius of 10 pixels. You don't want to. If you want to create a square, you want to make sure you hold Shift and Alt. If you don't, you could just drag and release whenever you feel you should. So I got this shape. Let's say if you're doing design, here is your thumbnail. You could also do one for an icon example. So I'll just take this and paste it over. So I could just take this, make these smaller so you can do multiple examples. All right, so I just went on Twitter and found some thumbnails and uh, a bunch of icons. These are not made by me, just a disclaimer. So I don't claim credit for any of these. So take your thumbnail, find the box you wanna put it into. Make sure it goes right over. So for me, I wanna do this one right here. You wanna make sure you have the uh, thumbnail selected hold alt and go in between here and you just want to click and this is going to clip it into the container box we just resize it now we can add a little effect to the container box you got a stroke if you want and outer glow might look better so for this you can have maybe something like this i think that looks pretty nice so you can have it like that right and you can right click and you can go copy layer style click on a separate box hold shift to select all of these right click and go paste layer style and now this is gonna apply the effects to all of the boxes you have all right, I'm gonna put this one over here as well all right now you want to list your prices so to do that here's what we're gonna do um, a box with the random rectangle tool you do this um, you can apply the same effects if you go copy and paste and then you could um, rasterize layer style, control U, you can actually change the color. So 
I say I want to go with it. Maybe something like this. Take the text, you can copy it. If you hold Alt and just drag the layer, thumbnail. Uh, 5,000 Robux. Something like that. Icon, um, 2,000 Robux. Now that we have all this, there are some extra effects you could add. For example, you can make a new layer. Go to your brush tool. Make sure your hardness is on, on zero, all the way down. You can just color. If you hold Alt, you can actually just select the color from uh, the canvas. Just like that. Just some subtle, subtle lighting. And then you can go overlay. I mean, you can add a bunch more effects if you want. It's not really that important. I mean, this looks pretty nice. That's basically how you create a commission sheet. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please make sure to leave a like if this helps you. And uh, I'll see you next time. Also, check out our website. It's in the description. And it's right there on the screen. RobotsVisuals.com Peace.